Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making these delicious shrimp tacos. If you want to see how I make these, then just keep watching. So today I have with me again my granddaughter. It's Leia. Yay! Because she was such a great helper last time, I thought I'd bring her on again. And she's also going to be my... Taste tester. Taste tester, that's right. And today I'm going to make a shrimp taco along with an alcoholic beverage that is delicious. So you don't want to miss this, so keep watching. Mm -hmm. Ready to get started? Yep. Okay. So for this you're going to need some corn tortillas. This is what I'm using here. And then I have some cooked shrimp. It was the frozen cooked shrimp. It's already been peeled and deveined. And to that we're going to add some olive oil, chili powder, cumin powder, garlic powder, and salt. And don't worry if I'm not giving the exact amount of ingredients. All the ingredients will be listed below in the description bar. Then here we're gonna make some pico de gallo. And then for the slaw, I bought a bag that was already prepared. So I have my slaw in here. And to that, you're gonna add, I have some lime juice in here and pineapple juice and some cilantro. And then we're gonna add some salt. And then for your chipotle mayo, I have some mayonnaise, some honey, and then you buy the chipotle peppers that come in a can, and then you just take out some of the sauce that comes in adobo sauce. Just add it in here, mix it up. So first thing I'm gonna do is get this going, marinating on the shrimp, and then I'll prepare all this. So let's get this going. So let me get a little bit of olive oil in here. And since the shrimp is already cooked, it's Basically, I'm just heating it through. You can use raw shrimp if you want. Totally up to you. So let this get a little hot before I add my shrimp. I've already added the marinade to it. You can even do this ahead of time. You can prepare this the day before and just keep it in the fridge and serve it up when you're ready to eat. So just add your shrimp. Mix that around so it's heated through. So my shrimp has pretty much been heated through. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off. I'm gonna remove it from the heat. I'm gonna go start working on the slaw and my pico de gallo. So let's go take care of that right now. Okay, to your slaw mix, you wanna add your, lim your lime and your pineapple juice your chopped cilantro that's been rinsed. Always rinse your cilantro. And then some salt to taste. Let me stir that up. And now let's get started on our pico de gallo. And to your pico de gallo, you always want to squeeze some lime juice on there. And then add some salt. Mix that around. It's a very quick and easy meal to prepare. Here we go. Mmm, doesn't that look delicious? So here I'm warming up my corn tortilla. And then what I'm gonna do is put a little bit of olive oil on the comal here. I'll show you in a second. Just a little. And then just take that bottom so that way it can kind of hold its shape up. Just keep it like that for a few seconds until it can stay up on its own. So just like that. It'll help it so it doesn't fall apart. It's optional if you want to do that. Okay, so now let me plate this up. Okay, so here we have our shrimp in our tortilla. And see if I do in that little Putting the oil on the bottom, it kind of just stays up. Got a little bit hard so it won't fall apart. 
So now let's add our slaw, just like that. And now get some of that pico de gallo. Put that right on top. And now you want to drizzle your chipotle mayo on top as much or as little as you desire. And there you have it. A very delicious shrimp taco. Oh, my mouth is just watering looking at this. And now time for the beverage. This is called a vampiro. And in English, it means vampire. Why it's called vampiro, I don't know, but it's delicious. So for that, you need some tequila. And this is what my husband prefers to use. It is the white tequila. And then some sangrita, viuda de Sanchez. This right here is the sabor, the flavor right here. And then you need some squirt, okay? First things first, you get yourself a glass. And then right here, I have some lime juice. Just gonna dip the rim in the lime juice. And this part is optional. You can rim it with salt, but I'm gonna rim mine with tahin, okay? Get your tahin or your salt on the rim. Pour you some ice. Then I have the juice of one fresh lime. I'm gonna pour that on top of the ice. Then I'm gonna take my shot glass Fill this with some tequila. Now I know some of you are still at home in quarantine, but take it easy, okay? Pour this into your glass. And then I'm gonna take this, fill the shot glass up two times with this. like that and then you're gonna top it with the squirt so all I did was fill the rest up with squirt I'm gonna get a straw and stir that up and here you go vampiro and I'm gonna tell you this is my favorite drink besides a margarita this is my second best favorite drink now let me tell you what it tastes like. I already know, but let me describe it for you. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, this is delicious. Try and make this perfect for single de mile that's coming up. You won't regret it. I highly recommend it. Cheers. And now we're going to try this, okay? She didn't want the pico de gallo, she just wanted the slaw and the chipotle mayo. So, and she loves shrimp, so let's see. <laughs> Go ahead. Wow, that was a big bite. Mmm. Pretty big bite. <laughs> For not knowing if you would like it, that was a pretty big bite. One hour later so what did you think how does it taste one hour later she's still chewing is it good would you recommend this for them to try this is very delicious it's got a lot of flavor going on here the freshness of the pico de gallo that creamy smoky chipotle mayo it's good right it's delicious it's really good it's really good so on a scale of one to ten what would you give this thank you <laughs> if you want to try this food, you can. Just try to make it if you can. Okay, so there you have it. She liked it. She gave it a thumbs up. I highly recommend you try it. If you like this video, uh -huh. and if you liked my little taste tester, give this a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Mm -hmm. Hit that notification bell so mm -hmm. that you'll get notified whenever I upload a video. I hope everyone is staying safe. Continue to sanitize and disinfect your hands 
not your internal organs. And on that note, bye guys. See you in my next video. Bye.